Welcome to the rocket profile of the KSLV-2, South Korea's next generation satellite launch vehicle. South Korea's first satellite launcher was the KSLV, also called the Naro-1, and made its one successful launch on January 30th, 2013. Since then, effort has been put into a more advanced launcher using indigenous engines called either KSLV-2 or Naro-2, which would be able to launch 2.6 tons into low Earth orbit. The first stage engines are four kerosene oxygen engines, either designated LRE-75 or KARI-75, with the 75 indicating 75 tons of thrust, which equates to 735 to 748 kilonewtons of thrust in vacuum, depending on the source. The four engines have a burn time of 2 minutes and 7 seconds, and have a vacuum-specific impulse of 298 seconds. The second stage is a single vacuum variant of the first stage engines, featuring a larger vacuum optimized nozzle. It will have somewhat more thrust than the 748 kilonewtons of thrust of the first stage engines, with a specific impulse of 315 seconds, burning for 2 minutes and 27 seconds. The final stage is also a kerosene oxygen engine, but is the smaller LRE-7 with 7 tons of thrust, one source gives the exact thrust as 68.7 kilonewtons. The engine's ISP in vacuum is 325 seconds, and it would burn for a possible 8 minutes and 20 seconds. Because of the proximity of neighboring countries, the KSLV-2 will launch southward, and will mostly be used for polar and sun-synchronous orbits. All rocket engines on the launcher have been developed in South Korea, and the first launch is expected to take place in 2021. And with that, thank you for watching this rocket profile of the KSLV-2.